Ready to rock? Ready to go. What's up, Expert Nation? It is Saturday about 6.30 in the morning. We are up early. We are putting Gary Vaynerchuk's Trash Talk Challenge to the test. Uh, we started eBay about 26 hours ago. We've already made two sales. So today we're hitting the yard sales. We're gonna document this entire process for you guys to really prove if the flip life is real there are people out there claiming that you can make an extra 500 to a thousand dollars a week going to yard sales selling stuff from your house uh selling things in your house that you no longer want so we are putting that to the test um and this is we're documenting it and this is our series flip life so we look forward to sharing it with you so let's go It's early. It's cold. We're off. Flip life. Here we go. So I believe Tia has four, right? Four? Two over here and then there's five up north. So we have seven destinations picked out that we're going to try to hit today for that flip life. So we are taking the Gary Vaynerchuk Trash Talk Challenge and we set up our eBay. That, I mean, we've had eBay, but it's been dormant, but we decided to jump back on there. There are claims that you can make 500 to $1,000 extra a week. So we got everything set up about 26 hours ago. We already have two sales just from stuff, pop culture stuff around our house that we wanna get rid of. Now we're hitting the yard sales to see if we can find some bargains and we're going to document the whole process for you guys so that you guys could do it too and see what results we're actually getting. So we're getting some fuel and we're going to hit the road. Let's go flip life. Get a flip life. Flip life. Flip life. All right, first stop. We're checking it out kind of like in a trailer park kind of community park we're gonna get out we're gonna take a look around see what they got so uh let's let's do it All right, we're just leaving the first yard sale. It was a community yard sale. The place was packed out with all kinds of stuff and we found deals galore. I'm gonna share it with you guys later. There'll be a breakdown in the video of all the stuff we found. I bought an entire box of New York Yankee baseball players autographs for $6.50. Just looking up one of the guys, he's an all-star. His autograph sells for $30. We picked up a cookie jar for how much? A dollar. A dollar. It sells for thirty dollars all day long, guys. The flip life is real. No bullshit from Gary V. We're gonna show you the stuff that we bought. It is crazy. That's stop number one. Here we go. Flip life. All right, guys. We're at estate sale number two, and uh, they got signs all over the place. Oh, this place is loaded. There's a lot. There's one right there. Let's hit that. All right, we found two houses taken. One looks a little anemic, but we're gonna go check it out. The other one looks, I don't know, looks like they got clothes and stuff, but we're gonna go see. You ready? Yeah. All right, let's do it. This is like our fourth or fifth stop. Oh, weight bench. Yeah. So we just came across a sale yard sale but she knew what she had she had a christmas village and the minute we tried to buy the entire lot she had about i don't know 12 pieces yeah. but the minute we tried to buy it she you know hit us with uh, on ebay these sell for 50 to 100 dollars so she knew pretty it. much over at that point <laughs> yeah she knew what what she had so there was no way we are 
ahead of the game. We have a $20 investment so far in the goods that we have and I'm confident that we have close to five or $600 worth of stuff. So um, we passed on the houses. It broke my heart because I wanted them. But, you know, Gary V says, as soon as they throw in that eBay game, you gotta, you gotta disengage, you gotta walk away because it, it's no longer, the purity of the deal is tainted. So we're gonna keep, keep going and see what else we can find. This was stop number five or six for us. So it continues. Here, I'll give you a shot. left the neighborhood uh, that was having a neighborhood estate sale I we, we killed it I think we uh, I think we picked up some good stuff flower plushy paid a buck uh, selling right now $17.99 on eBay we're taking a break America runs on Duncan so the split life We've stumbled across another multiple neighborhood yard sale, so we're gonna walk the street. But some chick took me for Hot Wheels. She wanted 10 bucks for a Hot Wheels new in package. I looked it up, it was $5.99. But that's, you know, it's our first yeah. time. You live and learn. Uh, you know. <laughs> Flip life. Whatever. Just tried to pick up a lot of like five Nerf guns. You know, it's always hit or miss with those Nerf guns, but the guy just wouldn't budge. There were some there with no price tag. I think the guy wanted uh, four, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12. He wanted $14 and we picked up some other things that they didn't know the value of, which we think we're gonna make some good money on the flip, but he just wouldn't budge on the Nerf guns. So I had to walk away from it. And I mean, it hurts, but at the same time, once people tell you, I know what they sell for on eBay, you gotta let it go because you've lost the playing field. You've lost the leverage that you have um, in negotiating, you know what I mean? I just picked up six set Pier 1 Cochina uh, Bistro style little mini plates. She six seven. of them. What, what was it? She wanted seven. She, she didn't, didn't get it. it. I paid five. Just looked them up. Eighteen ninety-five each. Selling on eBay. One hundred and thirteen dollars. Five dollars for one hundred and thirteen. What's up, guys? We are back home. We are getting some lunch, and then we're gonna start sorting. This is all the stuff we got. Uh, a whole wagon worth of stuff. We spent fifty-two seventy-five. That's what we spent today. Already starting to look up. Jumbo Ellie uh, Beanie Baby with the tag. One sold two days ago on eBay for $45.50. We bought it for a dollar. One dollar, one just sold for $45.50 on eBay. That's the kind of potential it is all day long. I am super excited to see um, what our grand total is going to be. We spent $52.75 and we're excited to see what's up.